Go. Okay, our fifth factor is shaft diameter. And most people seem to think that you go smaller and smaller and smaller in shaft, you get an increase in penetration. Uh, we do find an increase in penetration when the shaft diameter is smaller than the ferrule diameter of the broadhead. If it's 5% or more smaller, then you get an increase in penetration that averages about 10%. Now, going more than 5% smaller did not show any significant gain in penetration uh, beyond what you get at that 5% difference, 5% shaft smaller than the ferrule diameter of the broadhead. Uh, if the shaft diameter is larger than the ferrule of the broadhead, you can lose as much as 30% of your penetration compared to a parallel shaft. So you're looking at a potential 40% difference in penetration, depending on whether your shaft is larger than the broadhead's ferrule or smaller than the broadhead's ferrule. It's a very straightforward factor. You do not want to shoot a shaft that has a diameter greater than the ferrule diameter of your broadhead. And at the worst, you want it equal. But if you go smaller by 5% with the shaft, you will gain that extra 10% penetration.